James Anderson from the pavilion end. Just short of Matt Pryor, what a start that would have been. That's the response, and what a response it is. Not unfamiliar either from Saurabh Danguli. That'll be four more, it's gone fine, the fine leg is quite wide as well. Man out there, but it's over his head, it's flashed over his head, I think it's gone all the way, no, the umpire has signalled four. It was very close to Stuart Broad. Anderson continuing. Oh, he's gone this time, he's had a torrid time, Ganguly out there in the centre. And finally, England rewarded. Outside edge and Flintoff making no mistake. That's a good hit. He knew exactly what he was doing, Tendulka. And he goes again, over cover this time. Peterson was leaping in the air. And it's consecutive boundaries for Tendulka. Luke Wright taking the catch, inches from the ground. Great delivery, great delivery, he's got him. Through uh, between inside edge, or maybe off the inside edge and pads. Uh, Drava didn't like it, I don't think. He didn't seem to want to go. He's got to go because the finger's gone up. So another great wicket for uh, Andrew Flintoff. And Sachin Tendulkar can't believe it either. Well, I'm sure the uh, Indian fans, Indian players will be watching this very, very closely, but uh, the verdict has been given. That's high, and it's got the distance too. It's into the grandstand. Stuart Broad back into the attack, taking over from James Anderson. And we don't need technology there. Four. Bouncer pulled away. Another boundary for Atapa. He moves to 14. It's in the air to mid off and gone. Good catch from Anderson, Mascarenas has the breakthrough. India in trouble, 106 for five. Overall economy rate through his career is 4.6. Beautifully struck. Very crisp sweep shot. And a rare boundary. Out. Perfectly positioned at slip. Paul Collingwood, the captain, takes the catch. And Dimitri Mascarenas now has two wickets at the cost of just seven runs. That's the ball he's got to get out of his system. Short, wide, cut away for four. Flicked away. A little bit of inside edge. Gone fine, gone for four. This could be tight as well, taken in front of the stumps. Ian Gould, two balls running now, the umpire's call for the third umpire, Shah the fielder. Well, I think this time he's gone. He's tried to dive in, but the Dales had clearly dislodged the bat. It's not over the line. And that could be gone as well, good work from Matt Pryor. He's given him out, no need to call for the third umpire. Excellent work, Mascarenas, excellent work, Pryor. Edged, just fine of Paul Collingwood at slip. Yeah. Balled him. That's number nine. Well, you could see that coming in the sense that Zahir was going to take a chance with the field up. 
I think the four more. And he's really going to take this task on now. Wow, that could have been damaging. Alim Dar, very agile there. Well, he's a, he's a young umpire, he's still not 40. Alim Dar, good reflexes. We're looking for more than a single here. May go all the way. It does. Two boundaries in this over already. There's a man at long on, but it's over his head. It's gone all the way. Now, this is Tony at his explosive best. What's the bat speed here? It's down to long off. A man is coming around. And he does. Anderson has good hands. Not just a fast bowler, but a proper athlete. Yes, that's he's made that catch look easy. Never easy. The ball was going away from him. Wild response from RP Singh. Gone. Gone. High on the bat. Too quick it was for the stroke, and it went high on the bat. And Luke Wright's promotion to the top of the order has failed to work today. That's out, that's an edge. Matt Pryor's poor form continues. The opening partnership hasn't worked today. He's gone for none as well. Fine shot. Beats the dive at uh, mid-off. Beautiful play. Over the top, it's going to be a couple of bounces and four. That's over mid-wicket, not quite out of the screws, not quite out the middle, but there's a slope to help it. Easy meets, easy pickings for Ian Bell. Every time they drop it short, he seems to hit it harder. Up the hill he goes, all the way for four. Up comes the 50 for England, 50 for two. Easy shot, really, for Ian Bell in this form. But he has played it well. No one down the ground. One bounce and over. Simply two for two. No, 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 that's his trouble. Well, they'll be taking a look at that. Bit of confusion between the two. I'm backing the fielder at this stage. And that's why. What a mix up. No one out, and even if there was, he wouldn't be far enough. Not even Joel Garner would have reached that one, Mikey. That's a long way back. Oh. And that's a good shot. That's punished Charlie in this over. That's a good shot. He just eased it through the offside and will get a boundary for it. He's gone through the offside again, another boundary. So the run's coming thick and fast. This occasion, a good use of the feet. Oh, he's uh, got hold of that in style. And smashed it into the crowd. That's a good shot. No need to run for that. Quick on his feet on that occasion, Peterson. Excellently played by Paul Collingwood. You can't catch that up down the slope. Beautifully timed. 
clipped away again. Same shot, same result. Back to back boundaries. Can't get out there. No way. Four for Peterson, 50 for Peterson. Consecutive half centuries for Kevin Peterson. Coming at a time when he needs a few one-day runs, really. He's still got an outstanding record in this form of the game, averaging over 50, but recent times his performances had start to just drop away a little bit. Remember, England leave for South Africa tomorrow. Collingwood's just dealing in boundaries at the moment. The moment he gets on strike, he hits another one. He wants the two to bring up his half-century. Another excellent innings from England's one-day captain. This uh, time it's come in 58 balls, it's included five fours and one. Blitz of a pull stroke for a six. 17th ODI, 50 to go with his 400s. Like I said earlier, he looks in fantastic form with the bat. Very strong there, Paul Collingwood. Fielders just look, they know it's four. And they need just 27. Short and pulled away again. This is fantastic batting from Paul Collingwood. It's a good statement of intent, isn't it, from the captain? We don't just want to win, let's win it in style. Pass to Tapur again, the man in the deep won't stop it this time. England closing in on victory. Swept away. And goes for four, Zahir Khan doing the right thing. There's no need for a dive there. Down the pitch, up in the air, it's gone a long way up. Will it go all the way? Tries to creep over the line, Kevin Peterson comes back for three. And England win the match and they win the NatWest series. Four games to three, Kevin Peterson not out 71, Paul Collingwood not out 64. A comprehensive victory.